really made people feel like we're constantly at risk. But it's nice everyone's it. looking out for each other as well. It's good. So yeah, it's good. good. Well, earning money is one thing, but budgeting that money, hoy, 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 that's yeah. hard, isn't it? Especially <laughs> for people with a fluctuating income. And we know that a lot of you may fall into that category. So 13 Action News reporter Nina Porchenkula spoke with a financial expert for advice to help you manage your hard earned money. Nina. Well, in a city like Las Vegas that thrives on food and dining, entertainment, and a lot of other services, there are many people out there that rely on tips, maybe a eight bucks here, four bucks there. Others rely on commission. And our financial expert tells me it may be challenging to budget, but it is possible because of these simple ways. The first thing to do is get some income tracking going. So take a week, two weeks, four weeks, depending on how often you're paid, and you'll see what your base income is. That means how much you earn on average. Financial expert Steve Buden says whatever number you come up with should be your bare bones budget. The next step is know your fixed living expenses. These include things like groceries, rent, mortgage, phone bill, insurance payments. Compare the total of all that to your bare bones budget and whatever is left should be put in separate savings accounts. First, in a rainy day account to cover unexpected expenses. A good rainy day account would be something you don't have a credit card attached to or a debit card attached to, something that makes it difficult to access. It's really there, not for day-to-day -day purposes. It's and then, if you still have extra money, put that in a bonus account which you can use for dining out, travel, and other lifestyle choices. But once you see some success and you see some of that extra money accumulate, then it really becomes a nice mind game because as you see those numbers grow, it'll make you more incentivized to keep doing it. Yeah, and the key here is planning and prioritizing. Now, it sounds like it's easier said than done, as it always is with budgeting, but guys, it's possible if you have discipline. <laughs> Wait, what was that word? Sorry, that word. <laughs> I struggle with it too, but you know what? Uh, as long as you <laughs> have focus, laser focus on what your bu target budget is, you can do it. <laughs> All right, discipline, that dirty little word. All yeah. right, thanks so much for the great advice. <laughs> well, according to a new poll, nearly half of young Americans